when we first started People's Do Nothing on YouTube, where we just like fucking about as webisodes, the first thing I said is, like, I don't know, man, because people ain't going to take my rap shit seriously. You know what I mean? Because it was all about an image and what well, I thought. You know, yeah. there is no image there. When you you didn't want it to, you <laughs> didn't want, yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't want it to go monkeys. Yeah. yeah you yeah, wanted yeah. it to be like, I'm the rapper, then I'm That's the right. I always say that. Yeah, you're not performing monkey. Yeah, exactly yeah. that. No, yeah. it's in like the band, the monkeys. You know? oh, okay. If they had that show, right? They had the, they yeah, had the, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, they had yeah. the show, and then they had the. the, the, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so at that point with beats mm. and you guys just establishing like friendship, what? So you were just into hip hop? That was just yeah, the thing. yeah. That was it, man. It was just like I guess these guys called First and Last took me around his studio, and I'm thinking, um, yeah, I don't know, like I don't know who's gonna be, like you know, what I mean, mm. it's just gonna be music. <laughs> Turn up, like record my little bar and that, and then um, end up just like just staying and smoking a bit of weed with him and just like fucking about and and it turns out he used to do pirate radio back in the day so we're sharing stories about that and yeah were you into the office yeah no i'm into the office we're watching it you know rewinding parts redoing it and it's when camera phones uh like first came out innit? Yeah, yeah yeah so um we were just like just filming each other just for jokes like yeah, yeah. Just pretending to be these mad musicians or just the mad A and R or yeah. something, you know what I mean? Yeah, Literally, yeah, yeah, yeah. just so we can watch it back, smoke a joint, and laugh at it. Yeah, yeah, like, totally. that's it. Because like, you're editing it yourself as well, and that can be quite it's, funny. No, not even that, bro. Just literally, just pressing play again and watching it, <laughs> and being like, ah, that's jokes, delete. You know Sounds what I mean? like one of my podcasts. <laughs> 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 that's just me warming up yeah. on my own. <laughs> that's me on my own here, yeah. <laughs> um, dude. You do though. However, there is this mental process that because when you're doing it for a laugh and you're just getting high and just you know yeah. ah, look that's funny then it, some people just do nothing yeah yeah yeah. that's exactly it yeah yeah that's what i mean like it's that's why that name steve thought of the name like got to yeah. give credit to steve because when we was like when we was breaking it down it's like all these things we used to do like we used to like get a little draw go pirate radio mm. You know, couple heads are listening. Mm. You know, mm. whatever might go on a little brew race, whatever little thing. Mm. Yeah, but at the end of the day, nothing really happens. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, and that's what people just do nothing is about. Mm. Isn't it? It's the self importance of that world for you, yeah. but outside of it, nothing's really happening. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, You're yeah. not really going anywhere with it. It's just there. It's an irony, isn't it? Yeah, for sure. But that's also the beauty of it. Yeah. Because you're not chasing anything. It's just, it's purely for the process. Yeah, do you yeah. know what I mean? And and those characters don't yeah. learn that till till the end. Yeah, you know? I was there from the jump on the early early episodes. Big shout, out James Russian. I know you're watching. Yeah, dear friend of Man mine, like Russian. Yeah, yeah. Hold tight, James. <laughs> because because James James is a very established producer, prodigy, Bibi Clyro. Who else? Wow. Who but we were in the studio and it became our new thing. Mm. We would wait until we would because this was on YouTube. Or, or yeah, was this was YouTube mm. time. Mm. This was, and it was proper. I think there must have been nothing more than 20 minutes long. Oh, bad. It's 12, 8 minutes long. Yeah. But we'd be watching, waiting for the next one to come on. It'd be like you guys, what you and Hugo used to do in the studio, yeah. waiting for Office. Office, or, yeah, yeah. We yeah. were like that with yours. And we were like, oh, Crazy. this is... Are they serious? Yeah. But it's it's actually funny. It's, it's like, so we want more. Yeah. We're waiting for the next one to come. And then we just waited into these... <laughs> Wormholes. I mean, just the one way. I mean, listen. I'm now gonna. Be, I'm gonna be that guy now. <laughs> like the one where you're doing the exercising for the music video. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm that guy. You know that it happened. You were so. It was so relative. It was so true to um to our culture. Yeah, 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 yeah. for sure. And that's how it started. It was people like you lot watching it. It was just musicians watching it. Because mm. when we first started, we. Again, like, there was no, um, oh, we're going to do this and blow and everyone's going to watch it. No, it was like, we're just going to do it for our friends. Like, yeah, yeah. this is a bit like, we just had a Facebook, our personal Facebook, <laughs> that's it, you know what I mean? Yeah. And uh, it's when YouTube was still, um, at the time, it wasn't even, like, original pieces of music. It would be, like, ripped bits of music. Mm -hmm. It would be a cat spinning on a chair. Yeah, do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. And a few little heads doing, like, you know, like, maybe, like, Shadrach and Amandem and shit like that back yeah. then. Um, and it was one of them ones where, it actually started because me, everyone is Hugo's friend. So Steve, Asim, who plays Jabadi G, um, like they were both Hugo's friends. Like Hugo grew up with Steve and then mm. Asim was like a rapper that Hugo used to work with. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So he is the glue. He, he's the like the middle person that like connected us all together. And that's what I'm saying about I didn't really have people like that around me mm. to, you know, because I never wanted to be an actor or anything yeah. like that. And... 
that sort of like, I'll oh, just try things, fuck it, doesn't matter. That mm. sort of attitude I never had. It was, so it's, this is all them lot, do you know what I mean? It's all them lot like... I don't want to put you into like any hot water here. It's good mm-hmm. get a bit spicy, but it's not intention. Would you say, because Hugo, um, like you say, he's a, he's a glue. Mm. He's the glue to this this world. Mm-hmm. And you come from this world. And that this, it was almost like an inauguration mm. to a whole new... Like yeah. people would with university and like this. Yeah, sort of yeah, thing. for sure. You know yeah, I mean? yeah, it was a different new stage in my the life. Next stage. Yeah, where where you just didn't care what people thought as much yeah. anymore and stuff like that. And but what happened to what happened to the old, the old Sipa? Did it? Was it a case that I mean, whole time again? Marcus and now, see, I mean, like you've got your yeah. you've got your bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you yeah, know, yeah. These, and Kieran did day one as well. You've got your man. physicals, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, and everyone's yeah. from the jump. But yeah. but <clears throat> what I mean is like, did you feel? Was there a turbulent moment where you made that transition and you knew that there was going to be negative or positive mm. energies that were in your life that it was just going to change forever? Did, you knew that it was uh, that I didn't know it was going to change forever, but I knew that um, I needed to... Um, not even just people, but cut off certain mind frame and mm. way of thinking. And, you know what I mean? Because people just naturally grow apart anyway. Yeah. Like... Where I'm from, yeah, like in the sort of, let's say, golden era when you're younger and teenagers, mm. yeah, everyone was either an MC or a DJ or a graffer, it was creative. And the, mm. But then it stops and then it's like people either go this way or they get a job, become a builder, or what, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But there was no other creative outlet sort of thing. Uh, yeah. Like I even remember that there'd be like one or two heads, you know, and, and you'd be holding on to that, do you know what I mean? Yeah. But they've got their other shit to do. So it's like when I met these lot, I was like, this is sick. This is this is something I want to be doing under the evil know that I wanted to be doing. Do you know what I mean? Like, because I used to fuck around anyway. Like I was always that guy. But I just never had an outlet for it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, like I guess subconsciously that happened, but it wasn't like I sat there and was like, oh fuck these lot and these lot sick. (laughs) No, no, no. Although there are people out there that do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You know who you are. Yeah. Um, that's interesting. And I'm sure there's people out there that aren't happy for me. You know, this this how it is. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You can't. Whoa, son. Haters. (laughs) You can't. You can't please them all. Where'd you put me? Yeah. Um. Yeah. And this. when you're in that place, it, it really does feel like it, it's it's everything you ever wanted. But what people mm. don't see is up to that point, you are completely and utterly winging it. Yeah, you yeah. ain't got a clue what the fuck you're going to do. Hundred percent. And then this thing I, just I, happens. And one thing that I learned from everything I've been through as well is that we weren't. It's not like like these days. A lot of kids are like, "Yeah, oh, this is an earner. We got to do this. If we do this, then I'll earn this." Piece. You know what mm. I mean? It weren't that at mm-hmm. all. It weren't like. Oh, we're gonna be fa- like fuck that, and that was the good thing that I learned through through graph, through hip hop and stuff like that. Was that uh, to keep you grounded? That that mentality of work great, yeah, work great, and also like you're not just doing this for this. You're not doing it for the fact. Fe- you're not doing it for something to come back out of it. Mm. You're doing it because it feels good. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? And you've got to care about it. The yeah, more you right. care about it, the more of, the more does come back from it. Mm. The more you care about it. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but yeah. so that's what I'm saying. Like when. Uh, Hugo said to me, oh, my friend Steve, I'd never met before, is, uh, he's doing, you know, he went uni, Steve, and mm-hmm. he's travelling in Thailand, uh, do you want to go out there? You know, and I'm still of the mind state of, like, oh, if I can't get any bud out there, what, it's too far from, you know, like, yeah. <laughs> it's not open-minded at all, yeah? And I'm 19, no, I'm like 22, you know what I mean, at this yeah, yeah. Yeah, this you know, like, about, right? very, like, just where I'm from, and that's mm-hmm. it. And uh, went out there, met Steve, we connected straight away through comedy as well, that's and we so end up just, sick. like, kind of fucking about and you know terrorizing people on the beach in the sense of like um pretending we're on pills and going out to hippies and you know and they're like it's all good man and that's where his steve's character came from do you know what i mean uh, and like that that and that that wasn't his yeah. name when he's been steve's then it was just we were just all talking like that yeah because that's like how i used to sort of talk like where i'm from and that and they started talking and we used to just fuck about with these voices yeah. And then Steve, at the end of the trip, was like, oh, we should do something with this because he's more, like, academic. Like, he, you know, studied English writing at uni and stuff like that. Yeah, he script writes and everything. Yeah, exactly. That wasn't something that was in our, even, not even in our, like, it just wasn't even in our mind that you could do that. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, and... uh, and then when he said that, I even remember thinking, yeah, but no one really does anything, do they? Mm. Like, everyone just talks. You don't just. You can't just yeah. what film something and people watch it. Nah, do you know what I mean? Mm. And then we went back home, and then uh, Asim, who plays your buddy, he had a little Canon Seven D. So when 
people first started filming like little hood videos. You know what I mean? <laughs> Another one. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean? It looks like a normal they only like, last a photo like 15, camera. You can only film like 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah. And it looked like a normal photo camera. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. And I'm like, oh, well, you can't film on that. You know, like we were clueless. Yeah. And then, so luckily, you know, he had that. So he, so he was the cameraman at first. You know, him and Ben from Ben Brilliant, uh, from Brilliant, sorry. Um, them two were just our friends that had a camera. Right. And, wow. and that's weird. Okay. Do you know what I'm saying? Because he yeah. thought the same thing. He's like, no, I don't want to be in front of a camera. I'm a rapper. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, I want people to take me seriously. He asked him. Yeah, he, he used to spit. He was paradox. Yeah. Yeah, man. Like, he used to spit back in the day. My mind is blown. Yeah, yeah. No, he's a, he's a sick rapper, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone's yeah. looking at me like, yeah, you didn't know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did he? Yeah. There you go. Yeah. yeah. I think he's back at it, man. Knowledge. Like a crack at it. Yeah. <laughs> Big shout out to Asimon. So. Yeah, so that's that's kind of where that all started, and and then we basically just started filming it because we just wanted to post it on our little Facebook page, like yeah. our own pages, and if, see if our friends liked it or whatever. Yeah. And that's my point is that the next stage from that was people like you. Is it was it was people that were kind of in the music world. Mm. It doesn't have to be the garage world. It's just the music world because they could relate to it. Mm. They could relate to trying to make it, things going wrong, the fucking idiots that you meet <laughs> along the way. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And that's the first messages we started getting was like uh, pro green back then as well. And yeah. we're like, how do these people, oh, it must be being shared by people that understand the world. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. That was the first stage. Spinal because, Tap, isn't it? Y- yeah, I mean, it's that was banter. a big inspiration as yeah. well. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's the banter that, that's within, it's, it's, it's like a, it's like a, Institution, yeah, it's yeah, like, for sure. It's this thing where it's like, oh yeah, like, actually, I used yeah, to do that. Yeah, <laughs> and, and, and it's like we understand this. They yeah. might not understand it, but we understand it. Yeah. That sort of thing. So that's why it was. We never thought it could go past that. Yeah, because it's such a small world. Do you yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. But then it became musicians that weren't part of that world. You know, then then it became yeah, like Pro Green and Lily Allen clocked it. Yeah, yeah. And Lily Allen tweeted it, and we had like, you know, you got like uh, things that go viral overnight. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. yeah. Our, our first thing was like it took three years to get like twenty thousand views. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and then Lily Allen posted, tweeted it, and then it got twenty thousand views in one day. Yeah, yeah. That's when we first, the first ever glimpse of the power of, you know, the word that can be put out there. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, I do know what you mm. mean. Um, but it comes from a passion place, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> it's the best thing. So I'm saying, yeah, like because then it has you, its own momentum. You, exactly. Yeah, and 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 it doesn't. And if it doesn't get the momentum, it doesn't matter. You've already won because mm. you've put. You've already put everything you can into it and got what you need out of it. Do you know what I'm saying? But what I admire about you guys the most, and this is only from a, which I think is the deepest lineage that, that when we talk about the DNA of the show and how it relates to all of our circumstances, the stuff that we grew up on, the kind of things that go on in the music industry, the, 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 the underpinning amount of, you could, you could feel the, you could kind of feel the graft, the work rate, within you guys and you could tell that it was love yeah and that you probably would have just kept on going anyway yeah 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 exactly yeah i mean we took us a while man. Yeah. we we done like uh maybe like five webisodes in like four years but, yeah, yeah, yeah. but that's because everyone's got you've got things that you're getting a bit older so you need to pay bills you're doing yeah. this you, you got to be here it's, so it's all awesome. favors it's all for free yeah but exactly that like it was all because we just wanted to be there yeah. like we were like yeah sick I can't wait to once a month linking up with these lot and yeah, yeah, yeah. filming all day and then Asim having to go through fucking 12 hours of footage and get 8 minutes of gold out of it because most of it's shit that shit isn't easy neither mm, yeah uh, yeah oh man that, that's what I mean it's, it's all in the edit like shout out Asim yeah, yeah hold tight hold yeah. tight yeah. Uh, yeah tour de force and uh, man what a force it became <laughs>